bruh. Really? Do you honestly think you're fucking funny? What's going on you guys, welcome back, Zev here, and welcome to another clan war. Now, this clan war was freaking intense, um, you guys are gonna find out why. I'm not gonna show you guys the score until the very end, so let the suspense go. Now we're gonna take a look at a few replays from the war, and see how it went. We have number 3, Pierre Nuda from Florida, the enemy team attacking our Town Hall 8, number 5, Guardian. And he is using Go Ipo, which is a pretty weird attack strategy for a Town Hall 9, but it can be effective if used properly now. He's luring the Clan Castle troops out, he's gonna poison them, but now he's dropping 5 wizards on the Clan Castle troops. I don't know why, why would you use, why would you waste 6 wizards on them when you can just let them attack the golems and then kill them that way. So, now he's using the golems, but do you guys notice anything weird about this attack? Whoa, breakers, where are they? Um, so he's raging the golems to get through the wall, but no wall breakers, so hand lag. Um, so 10% 10 10 so far, zero star. He obviously, he's gonna three star this base, because any Town Hall 9 should be able to three star any Town Hall 8, doesn't matter max or not. Now he's dropping his king and the Packers are going in and they're gonna make their way into the core. But little does he know, the king, our king, is watching and he's gonna come out from the core and distract everyone. Now the witches are going in, one witch is going off to the right, the two are going into the core with everyone else. But they're about to get sniped by the cannon and there goes the witches. They're still high but not for long. Now he's dropping his Cloud Castle P.E.K.K.A and which is going straight into the core. His troops made through, now they're going off to the side, his king and his P.E.K.K.A is going for the elixir storage, now they're going for the mortar, they're not going into the core and he's healing them now. The P.E.K.K.A on the left is going on the, on the, for the defenses but his king is uh, halfway dead so. Um, he still has a witch on the right side, on the outside, which is helping take out the outside buildings along with the wizard. Now the gobs are going back into the core, but the packers are still going in a circle. So he has two packers remaining with the king. I believe the packer on the lower side uh, died already, but that doesn't matter. He's still gonna three star this guy because Town Hall Knights are strong. Boom! That bomb though. So two packers are still alive, one is about to go down, there he goes, king is about to go down, so we only have a mini golem, one packa and witch and a wizard. Now the Tesla is locking on two and then he failed, um, he was gonna get a three star but the time said no. 85%. One star Town Hall 9 fails on Town Hall 8. Now we're gonna watch the same guy number 3 attacking my base which is anti 3 star to most Town Hall 8s. But as you guys know number 3 is a Town Hall 9 so he should easily 3 star me. Now he's luring the my clan castle troops off to the side over here. He again doesn't have any wall breakers. I don't know what he is thinking. Um, now he's gonna drop the poison and he misses my balloon. So he's gonna use his wizards to lure the balloon into the poison range. I don't know why he uses three ray, three wizards when he can just use one. So he's just gonna wait until the balloon goes down and kill the dragon pretty fast. Uh, still has one minute and thirty seconds in the attack to three star me. Now he's gonna go from this side, from top, and he's gonna use his gun. What jump spell already? Sure brought a few uh, wall breakers now. What the hell is he doing? MOG rage. Now he's just dropping his wizards and the king. Now he's dropping his packers. Two packers are going shopping. He still has a clan castle pack, I believe. Or no, he has wizards which are going straight into the core. The rage spell went out and didn't help anyone. Now he's dropping his other packa, which is going into the core, but he's stuck on the wall. <laughs> Now the king is going shopping off to the side, what the hell, MOG heal, what is he healing, his golem who's max health, 
how to even get this guy. Another MOG here. What is this guy doing? Is he for real right now? So we only have golems going into the core. They made their way with the P.E.K.K.A. and a few wizards, I believe, but the... Um, little does he know, there is a giant bomb as a surprise. And it's gonna go down right about now. There's the giant bomb. Took out all of the troops in the core. Now he only has the Golem going for the Tessa and the P.E.K.K.A. on the left side, which is half health, and he's gonna go down pretty soon. So 47% so far, Zeta Star. Can he get at least a 1 star? I'm pretty sure he can not get a 1 star. Town Hall 9 fails twice on Town Hall 8. 47% that was a shitty attack. And so now you guys are going to see my attack on number 8 which has my exact base. Um, except he has a little bit lower defenses but this base is anti 3 star. Now because this was a super intense war, we were losing by a few stars, then we were winning, then we were losing again, and back to tie. So this was tied right now, and it was up to me to win. The whole clan was watching, I was like, shit, it was, I was so nervous. So I'm using my actual go wipe and going for the dragon, killing the dragon within a few seconds, and the dragon is going down. Now I'm dropping my wizards and Pegas, and they're going shopping, I was like, shit. And so I dropped my wizards on the further buildings to help get the P.E.K.K.A.s go back in. Now they're going back in and they're like, fuck this, I'm out. <laughs> now they're going back out for this compartment. I was like, you damn P.E.K.K.A.s, you're so stupid. But I'm gonna drop some wall breakers to help them break through the wall and make their way into the core. And the, there's a lot of splash damage, so I'm gonna drop the heal right about now and heal everyone, save my wizards. So I, I dropped my... Clan Castle P.E.K.K.A on the right side to let it shop uh, so I can get some of the buildings out of the way. Now the giant bomb, the wizards missed the giant bomb by inches. So the P.E.K.K.A on the right side, or uh, the king with the two wizards on the left side, they're going shopping. Now the king died and in the core there's three P.E.K.K.A's or two P.E.K.K.A's remaining, two golems and no wizard, so I was like, can I actually 3 star? There was 1 minute exactly in the attack left, 83% 2 stars so far. With every everyone watching in the clan, this was pretty intense. So now the Packers are going out, this Packer is going for the cannon, I was like, thank you Packer so much, you're finally finally a smart Packer. The other 2 P.E.K.K.A and lag again, the other 2 P.E.K.K.A are going on the outside, they're gonna clean up a few buildings and then make their way to the cannon. Now in the actual attack we have less than 10 seconds left, so it's coming down to the wire, 99% 1 star, can I get the 3 star and win? And I think I can, 100% 3 star anti 3 star base, so I was pretty excited to 3 star. And Let's look at the results. We won 56 to 55. If we tied, we would lose by percent destruction, but we won. And look at the war bonus. That is a hefty amount. So now let's take a look at the current war. Nine hours left before the battle day, and we're going against the level five Chinese or whatever clan, I don't even know. And look at number 15. Um, do you guys see anything wrong with this base? I don't, I think it's pretty maxed out. Uh, I don't think I can three star this guy. No, definitely not even one star. I think we lost, like, for sure. We lost this war because he's maxed out. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like as you guys always do. Follow me on Twitter. Ask me any question that you want if you want to be in my video. And subscribe if you are new and if you want to see more because I do daily videos. And as always, people. Fuck this shit, I'm out.